Pierre Jean, uh, I'm the uh, chair of the Australian Custodial Services Association. The custody landscape is, uh, is changing uh, quite uh, dramatically. We are seeing uh, the regulator putting a lot of thought around the way the industry is uh, shaped up, around how financial services should be uh, regulated, around how financial services should be providing information to the regulator, of course, but as well to the members, for instance, for the superannuation funds. And the custodians are typically uh, the uh, information or the data repository for superannuation funds and investment managers. And hence, any reporting requirement coming the financial services way in some way or form ends up on the custodian's desk. So our, the expectations from the industry on the custodian is evolving quite rapidly uh, and morphing into different uh, shapes of form. Custody in today's world is a truly a global game. Uh, it's a truly global game for two different reasons. The first one is your clients are becoming more global uh, than before. Um, global investment managers expect a global response to global needs. Hence, you will need to have uh, a proposition that can be uh, leverage of something operated out of Luxembourg, out of the US, out of Singapore, and out of Australia. So clients expect you to be global. Um, it is as well a global game simply because uh, investments are so considerable in terms of uh, uh, sustaining innovation, uh, keeping pace with regulation, uh, something like FATCA in the US is a, uh, is a massive investment for, for, for all custodians. And hence, you need to be able to uh, uh, apply these investments to the larger pool of assets that you can, that you can uh, assemble. And these pools of assets, by definition, are not being global. I'm regularly asked, you know, if, is, is custody a, a, a pure commodity? Uh, I'll say uh, some of it is a commodity process, uh, but the devil is in the details. Um, the evolution of our business is absolutely uh, uh, staggering. Uh, go back 20 odd years ago, a bit more unfortunately, uh, but I still recall what I was tasked to do the first day of my first job in the custody world. My first day of the custody world, I was to design a share certificate to have it printed by an authorized printer to have bearer share certificates, a, a sheet of paper that was afterwards going to be put into a vault. Okay, and that sounds like uh, 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 prehistorical times, but it's not that long ago. So let's put it this way. Um, Evolution is constant. Uh, innovation is, uh, is, is in the industry is, uh, is, is, is almost uh, occurring on a daily basis. Um, you'll have elements like you know, private equity investments. Ten years ago, private equity investments was, 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 was marginal. Today, uh, it is expected from custodians to be managing calendar of margin calls, uh, corporate events, uh, unlisted, uh, unlisted investments, and it's becoming part of your normal processes, your normal expectations. Um, things like mobile technology, mobile technology, uh, iPads, uh, reporting, and so on. Um, three years ago, that was a topic for discussion. Today, it is expected that you will get your reports out on, on an iPad anywhere you are in every shape or form. So yes, uh, evolution is, uh, is, is, is fast-paced, uh, evolution is quick. Uh, so that's my crystal ball tells me that in 2013 we'll be talking a lot about mobile technology, a lot about uh, unlisted vehicles.